He's gone, he's edged it. It's gone to Devon Smith, who's juggled. But he's taken the catch, and Alistair Cook has gone cheaply again. His heart must have been in his mouth, Devon Smith, when that ball bounced out. Not to release the bowler as well. He got an edged drop off his bowling in the first innings. Taylor, this time Smith hangs on on the second bounce. That's the first. They'll be hoping for early wickets with this new ball. It's one for one. That sorted that one out in a hurry. That is a gorgeous delivery. Taylor has done what every man in the West Indies wanted him to do. He has got rid of Kevin Peterson at the first attempt. The celebrations begin in the stands. Look at them in the background. They're loving it. The danger man has gone. What a sight for the local crowd. Peterson looks at the big screen. His off stump went flying back, just like the old days. A fast man, no loosener this time. Full and straight. And what a sight for the fast bowler. Off stump, cartwheeling back, a little bit of swing. And England's danger man's gone for one. It's 12 for three. Everyone goes up again, and now goes to finger as well. So Andrew Strauss becomes the next man to leave the stage. He's hung in there gamely, grimly even, for his nine runs. But he is now the fourth man out, and West Indies absolutely cock a -hoop. Well, that tells you something about that dismissal. There's no doubt, because the batsman himself has said, I am not referring it. So it tells you something about this. It is out. It has been edged. The noise is there, Strauss knew it, everyone knew it. Fine, fine bowling from Jerome Taylor, he has three for eight now. And the England captain leaves for nine, his side are in all sorts of trouble, 20 for four. I think it has hit the stumps, he's running, but the ball has hit the stumps. He's bowled. Collingwood has to go, he doesn't realise it, there's no clue what has happened, but the ball has snuck through, it was another excellent line from Jerome Taylor, nipping back at Collingwood, full, doing him for pace, and England in all kinds of disarray, that really summed it up with Collingwood being bowled and him pairing up and down the pitch for two, 23 for five. Well, this will give us a better idea here, inside edge, yes, and that's why he took off, but the ball just brushed the leg stump as it went down towards fine leg, Leg bail dismissed. He realized what had taken place, or is, is he sure? He's still appealing. It's 23 for five. Five wickets for Jerome Taylor. And they're only six down. Five for 11, 7.5 overs of superb fast bowling from Jerome Taylor. Honing in on that off stump. Ball after ball after ball at high pace. This one actually was a little bit slower. With a bit of off cut on it. There goes the finger action. Ball just nipping back through the gate and rocking that off stump straight out of the ground. Matt Pryor gone for none. Jerome Taylor absolutely delighted. And the West Indies right on top now, England 23 for six.